Okay. Hello all. This is D Swank. I'm in Stellaris. We're following the Empire of the Eternal Wheel. And uh hmm. Yeah, we'll we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, I think because the game has reset a couple of times uh, with mod updates and things like that, that's why that was popping up. Um, now we've... I'm trying to catch back up on what I have and haven't done. Okay, there's that. We've got seven months there, and then I believe the entire Arundel series will be immune to the species, will be immune to the plague, which is good. That's good for us. Uh, yeah. And then we'll start uh, dealing with the non arundel species. But hopefully we'll be able to hold all the space and we're doing some surveys up here. And I don't know where my military is. Oh yeah, we stopped because of the dimensional horror. So we're, we're going to have to figure that out. And then... Over here... Ah! That's good for them, I guess. Enemy invasion defeat. We've got a few days there. And once the uh system survey once I kind of get all the um, doom figured out for us. Okay, nothing new there. I'm kind of looking at all the planets or the systems I have here, seeing if uh any more planetaries uh, that I can do stuff with. Oh, yeah. Alright. Machine Age. Uh, yeah, let's, let's declare that we are your guardians. Uh, what are y'all? Late Medieval. System can't do that. Are your gods? Can't do that. Indoctrination. Yeah, we'll just wait on that one. I believe there was one more elsewhere that we were observing. Ah, right here. Yay! I believe now the entire Rondel species is immune. Species modified. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and modify these guys. Get rid of Obnoxious. Arms. Oh, Incoming oh I bet there's other... Construction complete. Enemy troops landing. Other folks on um, home. Situation uh, allow me to introduce myself. We need to make first Quaverans on... Trimba. We could choose an emissary to represent us, either the leader of a powerful nation, a scientist with an open mind, or random Kosovarians who want to believe. Alternatively, we could broadcast from orbit the whole planet, or just land a ship in the... Broadcast from orbit. I haven't seen what happens when I do that. Arms, yeah, we can do that. Enemy invasion defeated. All right, uh, Enemy another species. Enemy Humans modify. Species modify. Uh, we'll pull that off. Uh, make you immune. And industrious intelligence. Uh, 
Let's see. Using a small satellite network and some drones, commander of the observation post orbiting Trimba has said hello to every single Clavarian on the planet at the same time. Response has been incredibly bad. Mass suicides across the globe. Armies mobilizing. Frightening Clavarians chanting at the sky, begging for mercy. Felines and canines living together. Peaceful intentions. Um... Yeah, I, that's probably not going to go well for us, but... Eh. You made a mistake. Oh, well. Let's see. All the auspicious. That's nice. Uh, Enemy invasion defeated. Okay, I guess I can't give them a bunch of that. Ancient. Replicator. Swarm. Advanced physicist, advanced socialist, naturalist, brutal, survivalist, hunter. Eh, we'll modify you guys. Y'all aren't human anymore. And once you're join us, we'll give you citizen rights. Yes. Citizen rights. Alright, you? I guess we can go through this, start upgrading things. Survey. Species modified. Survey. And I think I'm gonna build one here. And I th think that'll zip this up. Two arms. Enemy troops landing. Uh, species? Uh, set default rights, full citizenship, yes. Alright, let's hit the same killy here, modify, I can give you that, but let's see. Uh, let's pull that, two arms. And modify enemy troops landing and research, yeah. Enemy invasion defeated. And then I'll do the same for this guy. Situation log update. Then I'll do trick. So I don't want to lose them. But I can go ahead and we'll go and build a colony ship. Using the small satellite network and drones established, the commander of the observation force, post observing Trimla, has made a second broadcast to every single uh, on the planet. At the same time, the commander made it clear that we are here as peaceful guides only, that we are here to guide all plus civilians, and that no advanced powers or knowledge or preferential treatment will be given. The response has been a little more positive and all auditory channels available to the Klesivarians are now being pointed at the sky. A few armies have stood down from high alert, and a few less Quivarians are chanting at the sky. That's enough broadcasts. Yeah, let's build two of those. Alright, new research. Okay, we'll have shields done soon. Hmm, what do I want to do here? Research complete. Enemy invasion defeated. Well, let's get that done. We already got some advance on that species. Oh, excuse me. Uh, modify. I was going to get rid of that. Modify. Research. Those should stack. And then we'll get a trick. Situation log updated. Okay. Okay. Species modified. System survey complete. Set rights for you. Full citizenship. Yes. Uh, we are going to modify you. 
Get that. Modify. Research. And who else? We need to hit Juatet. Situation log updated. Two. Alright. Enemy troops landing. Let's survey there. Let's grab you. Or do I have another construction ship? Ooh. Okay, cool. Enemy invasion. Details. Nice. I can start looking at people's ships. Nice, nice, nice. Century Sphere, let's upgrade you again. System survey complete. Get our arrays up and going. Alright, uh, species. Alright, Juatet. Modify. Let's do that. What's that? Slow Brooders. Yeah. Modify that. Research. And we'll get Seth in as complete. well. Situation log updated. And eventually we'll be done with that research. Wow. Sarah is a little terrifying, honestly. Ah, the Enomatic Fortress. That's cool. Construction complete. Got a dimensional horror there. I'm a little concerned about. Alright, now with the fortress. I think my next big thing that I'm gonna be working on is going to be my uh a uh, Dyson Sphere. I kind of want to get a Dyson Sphere on mine. Alright. Um, let's look here. What do we have? We lost one Lagoon class. So let's build that. Now we lost one Barrage, one Hermes, and one Liverpool. One of each destroyer. Right. Frigate survived, Artemis survived, I lost two victories and a Scharnhorst. Two victories and a Scharnhorst. There's the Scharnhorst, there's the two victories. Alright. Uh, species. Modify. Give you that. Research that. Already Situation done. Yes. Alright. Really? Species modified. Okay. That's strange. I didn't think I'd have people attacking or zumdums. Alright, species. Ah, you. Modify. You modify research, and now every species in the system, with the exception of the snakeoids, have are immune to the uh, the invasion. So we're doing pretty good there. Let's upgrade this. And then we're going to start building battle cruisers because I don't have any battle cruisers in here. Right? Ship designer. Give me that ship designer. Okay, battle cruiser. Let me get rid of that one. And then I want to design my battle sheep. Battle sheep. So I, I'm going to have two. Battleships. Uh, broadside bow, broadside core, broadside stern. Okay. I'll, ooh, I like that one. 
Our station order have been contacted by the President of the United States of Western Terimbia, requesting that communications and contact. Uh, we are here to guide all of you. Of that. What would be good here? Fire control systems. Fortunately, that is kind of pointless to me. I think artillery, just a couple of big guns. So, everything back here, being that, and then large weapons. Kinetic artillery. There we go. Now, shield capacitor. Shield capacitor. Um, structural integrity field. And corn crew. Uh, hyper shield. And then we need power. Ship needs to be powered. It's actually not bad. There we go. And then armor. Yeah, there's the Lexington class. And ship designer because I want a. Uh, we're gonna have the Lexington, and I think I'm gonna name the other one the Concord. Uh, yes. Now, the only one I have, I believe, for that slot is the Archimeter. Yeah, unfortunately. So, Plasma. And... No. Why not? We're going full on derp here. Um, shields. Okay. There's that. Now let's see what we have here. I want a clone crew. Shield capacitor. Shield capacitor. And structural integrity. Yeah. All right, and then there's that, and you are the Concord class, which will eventually be upgraded with better forward weapons. Concord class, I like having the Concord class. That's a that's a cool name to me. All right, what do we have? Better farms. Hull of Warriors. Let's do that. Okay, and we'll have the victories made soon. Hello? Sure. Incoming transmission. Thank you. Come up here and build an outpost. You survey here. You survey here. And that should zip this line up to where we have pretty much the entire run there. Alright, uh, you. Let's colonize. Here. Tebow D. Okay. And you. will colonize. That's a tough one to pick. But yeah. Tebo, Tebok. Tebo C. Alright. Got a couple of colonies coming in. Leader capacity? Yes, please. That is going to be quite helpful. And I'm going to need to start uh, upgrading my fleet pretty soon. Get everything higher. I kind of want to get these leveled up. I know this is the top tier torpedo, so. 
Alright. So, Sentry Spire. Now, we need to figure out where we're going to build Aswil. Aswil. Yes, this is the perfect one. We're going to build the uh, Dyson Sphere here. I thought I selected you. Military must be in the best shape. Move here. And that'll be quite helpful. 400 monies turn. Tebow D. Alright, what am I doing up here? I've got 12 months. Okay, I got the Bastion. What's my next one going to be? I could go with Navy. I don't have Master Builder yet, or do I? Yeah, I don't have Master System Builder yet. Uh, we could go Genesis, which incre <laughs> increases our et our death. Yeah, getting tongue tied. Um, Utogenesis looks interesting. Uh, breeding, what? Breeding pool? Ooh. Those are awesome. Burrow. A mutagenesis gives us an additional core system, and I may do it just for that. Uh, sensor range. So, exploration. Might not need that at this point. Uh, machinery? What's this do? Speed. Nothing there. So I think I'm going to go with Navy, honestly. That's kind of epic, actually. For the um, hive mind there. But we're not fanatics, so we can't really do any of this. Which I'm fine with. We're, I mean, we're not a fanatic empire, so... However, order does make sense for us. It looks really, really good for us. Uh, but Navy, because we we do have, um, our Navy is something that we do take pride in, so that would make sense. So, I may go with that. Bastion is something that, because we're kind of turning into this small area. Diplomacy makes sense. Aggression... Diplomacy makes sense because we are, well, we are who we are. So, I may go with diplomacy. Uh, aspiration. Yeah, I mean, this line right here. Oh, nice. Makes sense for me. Uh, more minerals. But I think I'm good. I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go with Navy. All right, you. Colony established. Colony established. Spaceport. All right, surface. Okay, we need to replace things on the surface with other Research things. Complete. But I'm not sure complete. which ones to select and replace. I think I'm going to replace you. Okay. Black Day Generator. 
Do I have anything else? Ministry of Truth, I want to build that. Uh, yeah, Ministry of Truth. We're going to put a Ministry of Truth in and a Black Day Generator. Ministry of Truth. Yes. What are you? Empire Capital. Energy Nexus. Do we have any more power plants on here? Yeah. Okay. You are going to be replaced with this. I'm pretty sure I can upgrade that again. Okay. And you know, I'm gonna go ahead and replace the other one with the lactate generator. Yeah. Alright, new research. Um, oh, all of these are good. Uh, honestly, I think that one's gonna do me best. And I was gonna go with Navy. do that. Alright. Those are all being built. Surface. Wow, we actually got a lot there very quickly. A lot of folks. I guess we can build spaceport one more colony ship one more thing um how far away are the century from being done oh, not that long I think there's one more after this that it gets Alright, uh, new research. Yeah. New research. Um, Sonic Carrier, that will be quite useful for our fleet. Yeah, I don't know why I keep bouncing over to look at that. Ah! <laughs> you colonized that. Damn you. Damn you, damn you, damn you. Alright. Construction complete. I have a feeling there's gonna be a war Okay. Uh, oh, Luke Temple. Okay. There's a lot of things here that I have kind of passed on. I didn't realize Luke Temple was one of them. Alright. Bing. Research, leader, civic slot. Research. Yeah. I like that. Alright, we are going to go ahead. Let's get a battleship. Let's get her battleship up. Three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Um, what do we want to go with? Yeah, that one. We'll have our battleship out. May have to dip diplo all these guys or.
see. I bet I could easily take these planets, but I don't have the planetary support I need to take those two. So, yes. Let's click on them. Okay. They have spiders. But... One of the things they don't have is... I don't see any cure for the disease. So... If we just... Wisdom for... Okay. Our scientists have learned a great deal about the subterranean temple, but... Uh, oh, this is... This is... Yeah, okay. This is way back from the second episode. Uh, Aru... Scientists have learned a great deal about the subterranean temple, but some questions remain. A roof aperture along with the radial altar suggest it was once the solar calendar, but it is so badly damaged by the earthquake... That we can't be certain. If the builders found particular date important, we'll never know which ones. We have better luck with unknown with the unknown alphabet. It's a debased variant of a better known heretic script, not an alien language at all, and we've successfully deciphered it. The temple is dedicated to the waiting worm, or the worm in waiting. Most of the inscriptions are sonorous poetic invocations requesting its appearance, or, if read in other direction, its departure. There is also a body of inscriptions describing the operations of the universe, which our more excitable archaeologist swears to contain references to advanced field equations. Nothing new to us, but very impressive for a temple of this vintage. We have yet to find a physicist who prepare, who's prepared to go on record as agreeing that the references are meaningful, though. The temple holds no cosmic secrets or alien weapons, as far as we can tell, but its dark spaces have a distinctive menacing beauty and poet poetry on the invocation to the worms, worm in waiting becomes fashionable. They are set to popular music, they are published in collections. Uh, reserve the temple for academic study. I ha I ha have a strong feeling that I'm I'm going down a bad path. Bad path. Colonize planet. Uh, Tebof. Boss. F. Okay, there we go. Now, I was, uh, yeah, prideful is being terraformed. Upgrade you. Spaceport, planet summary. Terraform you. Gaia World, because we're vanity. We are full of a vanity project. Trade deal? We agree. What's this? Okay, let's upgrade ours. Spaceport? So that all of our spaceports are in this area maxed out making it to where it's a very bad idea yay CAD Republic is at war with Sarah 
This might be the opportune time, actually, to declare war on Sarah and try and take uh, Quifoth and Warmar Warmaru and this area. So, um, I kind of want to. They're still building ships. So, do we go ahead and follow through? I don't have, well, I have a few armies. I have a pretty good army on Tebow. On, on Corbon. Armies. Embark all. Yeah, I mean, not fantastic, but... Uh, they're not bad. Yeah, let's put you with that army. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. I mean, I... Clear War, Quifoth. Okay. Uh, gotta find the... Yeah, we should investigate that. Walmaru. Quifoth. 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 Okay. We're going to go to war. Alright. Go. We have declared war. This was either genius or insanity. And I'm prepared to deal with both. Century array. Ah. A rent of us. By the success of the Empire of the Eternal Wheel, this is despite the fact that it isn't any ideas. The captain that was. The captain that appeared on our screen is clearly Zhang Stu, but a scarred, haunted, decrepit, wrecked edition of Zhang Stu, face glossy with plasma burns and older, much older. The bridge in the background looks just as scarred and just as decrepit, but the captain's voice is firm and clear. Finally, you're here. I've waited so long. My punishment is to die in battle against you. Prepare to please end me. I'm sorry. If you want to end it, why wait? A warship is full of ways to die. What happened here? Are you really Zhang Stu? Surrender whatever you've done. We can help you. Too late. Message. What was will be. The first fleet has located a small, minimally powered art artificial object broadcasting a looping signal at local range only. These sorts of things usually turn out to be escape pods, and this is what looks like one of those. It's been out here for a long time. When the crew cracks it open, carefully observing the quarantine procedure, they find an ancient remains preserved by the sterile pod environment. So far, not unusual. The captain of the first fleet indicates, however, that they will did not expect to find the Imperial world words. What was, what will be, what will be, was dubbed, dabbed on the wall of the bodily fluids of the pod's occupant. 
who the crew are now widely referring to as the messenger. They add that they are somewhat equally unexpected anatomical similarities between the messenger species and our own. Ew. Pause. All right. Situation log updated. Science ship under attack. Evading hostile fleet. This is the. Okay. Interesting. All right. I mean, it's a small ship that doesn't really matter. So it's, I mean, it's going to go up pretty quick, so. Zong's stew is silent in the days that follow. It is no small thing to hear that you are already dead, but in time that silence becomes determination and an almost reckless confidence. Worrying. Interesting. What does that mean? Brilliance. I'd love to know what that trait meant. It's a little unnerving. Yeah, go ahead. Let's engage here. Alien spaceport engaged. Clear these things out. Go that way. Science ship, go here. Eh. Okay. We're just knocking these things out. Right. Situation log updated. You situation log updated. Park yourself over drone cluster. Yeah. Only form up. Colony established. But Combat's... Oh, wow, that's cool. She's pretty freaking beastly. Surface. Oh, not many folks here. It appears the first Arundel settlements on this planet. number of facilities and residents have been carefully mothballed. And with a little restoration, we will serve our new colony well, but all records have been erased. Hmm. Interesting. Not entirely sure what that means, but interesting. All right. Land armies. Go this way. Ah, energy credits gained. Yay! Alright. Hostile station engaged. Construction complete. Alright. You guys. Production chamber. Enemy. Situation and Barkle. Land armies. Construction complete. Shouldn't be much here. Yeah. Hmm. 
And we'll take this entire sector real quick. Alright. Put yourself there. We should be taking this pretty dang fast. We out quality and out quantity them there. Now that's going to be a tough fight. Or tougher fight. Almost down. Land armies. Armies. Fleet. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. That poor transport fleet. Did they retreat? Did we take out the entire thing? Or. Oh, and we're gonna have this. Alright. This fleet, I wanna send it up. Take that out. Enemy planet secure. Um, take that out. And we're gonna head south to Cliffle. And then I'll start sending things up here to start wrecking face. Research. Four months on energy capacity. Alright, keep going. Come on. Station engaged. Oh, you're engaging the mining platform. Okay. Come on, mouse. Oh, wow. Situation log updated. that out. Come on. I don't like the them having this territory, so situation log updated. Ha. Well, that helps these guys as well, so uh, our latest contacts with Kavarians an advocate for increased interaction between us and the populace possessed establish an embassy on the planet. Commander of the observation post orbiting suggests that we instead create an embassy on the station and provide shuttle service. Uh, establish the embassy on the station. Our settlers were initially happy to make use of the buildings on Teboff. Their existence jump-started the colony, but now they've grown nervous. The rumors that these buildings may still have occupants or active, active security systems, although no evidence of either have been found, some colonists insi insist enigmatically that there are shadows in the walls. Discouraged with superstition, the buildings represent years of effort. Okay, so they're uh, somewhat afraid of that army. So the, there, we're going to take Sarah. Or this colony, Quiffle. Quiffle. 
And then we'll have secured the Empire. We'll have to come up here and start playing around with some of Sarah's military. But they're in kind of a tight spot because the Cad Republic is doing their thing there. So... I've got to watch this army, the combat swarm, but I'm pretty sure Situation log we out-quality them. Research complete. We'll get here. There's transport fleet with just one ship. Woo! Let's take the, the drone node. Research. Um, physics. More physics. One more rude. Here, let's go ahead. Armies embark all. Grab youth guys. We're sending you down here. Mark your happy butt here. Come on. Transport fleet jump. Transport fleet jump. Transport fleet. Move. You're going to go pop if you don't. Alright, slow time down. Three, two, one, jump, yes. Alright. One of these. Yeah, there's not much here, so we're gonna grab this army or this fleet. Send it up this way. See if we can engage their military survey system. Alright. Yep, knew that was going to happen. Destroyed. Land. Alright. Fleet, go. Come on. I'd like to get... I have an engagement. One major engagement. Before this episode ends. New research. Three months. I guess we could actually... Pause this for a second. Look at you. Take a look. Oh, they have dreadnoughts. But I think we are better. We have better shielding. Um, we have better battleships, it looks like. We have better shields, better armor. Um... Forget. Forget. Yeah. I think we're I think we're better than they are, so I wish we had a, a way of stopping them from jumping. But they're gonna jump. Yeah. Well. Ah, uh, we did target them for battle, so that's good. Oh. Hey, hey. 
you guys are, yeah, you, we are landing. The armies are landing. Alright. Construction complete. Yep. Hit him. I don't care if we lose him. I don't station even care if we lose the other. Mining station lost. Okay. I just can't catch Resume these bastards. Um. Advanced dreadnoughts. More wind missiles. Uh, interesting news from Tiboff, where we found those abandoned buildings. Census shows too many settlers records on a new colony are always unreliable, but as far as we can tell, they have authentic citizen IDs, and no one on the world has suggested there are any mysterious strangers. But the birth rate must have been extraordinarily high, or we have unlicensed migration or something. Somehow the population is higher than we might reasonably suspect. Investigate. Um, let's go with that. Are we fighting them yet? Yes! 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 I don't think we really lost anything either. Situation updated. Okay, System we might complete. have lost one ship. Nope, that was one of our battle cruisers, so. Yay. That was good for us. Uh, armies? Alright. Situation log updated. We'll take a look at that soon. Yeah, we're we're gonna win that. Alright, we'll take that. Should have been a pretty high war score bonus for us. Oh, 0. 0.5. Yes, are we expected to win this war? Is that just... Situation if you lo if we lose this, it's kind of a joke on our, far our part? Either way, once we have everything that we want in this area locked down... We'll start moving on with the next phase. Speaking of next phase... Um, more power. What do we need? Okay. 1,000. So in a couple more months, we'll have that wrapped up. You. Park yourself in orbit. Oh wow, our energy credits are not doing too hot. Alright, we'll knock that out. Uh, research project, you... There's something. Yeah, there's that. So grab you, send it here. So we can do research projects. Who is that? That is. these guys. Ooh. <gasps> they found a Dyson Sphere. That's kind of epic. Or they have a found Dyson Sphere. Situation That's cool. Updated. All right, so we've knocked everything out here. Um, the view up here. Uh, to where? Where's my science ship? I could have sworn I had another science ship up here. I guess not. Alright, um, let's send you down here and start building mining stations all the way up. You, the 
Magellan. And I guess I'll have the Tesla coming through here, surveying and doing things. Oh, nice. That one's done. Loop Institute. Research complete. That, that's interesting. Loop. I wonder... Debris analyzed. Okay, we can reform the... Reform government. Let's see. We need to add something in here. Um... Telecommunication increases course. Yeah. And now I don't have to worry about when I get those two systems. Yay! Um, let's see. Study the messenger. We've got a lot of research going on. Another update from Tiboff, where we found the abandoned buildings. The number of columns continues to increase, and now we're finding irregularities in the records. Family groups that shouldn't exist. Birth dates that make no sense. There must be a secret migration from a lost colony, or else some peculiar sabotage by the colonists. Okay. Our engineers set charges and retire to a safe distance. The buildings are reduced to ruins. Eventually the ruins will crack and crumble to boulders, pebbles, dust under the assault of wind, roots, and rain. But their shell will endure for centuries yet, and there will be stories. We'll hear of the shadows in the stone by day, blue lights by night. Our colonists will avoid them. They'll attract no visitors. Uh, nothing is forgotten. Tiboff. That was over here. Surface. Part of me thinks I should have just kept going with it, but, eh. Replace you... I'll go ahead with Colony Ops Center there. Place you. Hydrocell, yes. Build. Hydropower plant. Build. Hydropower plant. Hydropower plant. This is going to have a lot of hydropower plants. Uh, hydropower plants. We need more energy. No energy. All right. Um, let's see. I'm I'm getting pretty close to where I'm gonna have to start wrapping this up. So I want to get you researched, and then we'll call it. So let's get you researching there. We'll call this episode here. We've engaged the Empire of Sarah, and we're, well, once we have these two planetary systems, we'll have zipped up and secured our territory. Uh, we're, we'll be a pretty good sized empire, uh, looking at the Vespucian Empire, and Sarah herself being relatively large, but she's at war with the Cad Republic. We are fairly lucky in the fact that there's no fallen empires immediately nearby. Which is going to help us greatly. However, 
we are at a point where wow wow they're going after us full on um I'm trying to figure out where I want to go to war, or where I'm sending my empire next, or my fleet next. Could go here. That's not a significant defensive station, so we could probably take the these colonies here. Just kind of work our way through this, and I'd be happy with it. Cad Republic. Ooh, nice. Are y'all still at war? It, no, you are still at war with those guys. That is a fairly impressive battleship. But anyway, before I get too caught up, I do need to go ahead and end this. So, I hope you enjoyed it. The, the disease fear is over, and I will see you next time. Until then, buh bye bye